Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill drag daily challenge using Python programming language. Let us understand our question. We have to accept the R cross C matrix that is uh, R cross C integer matrix from the user. Then we have to print yes if every row and column of a matrix is a palindrome else we have to print no so consider our test case here we have four cross four matrix and in our first row we have one two two one which is a palindrome as here we have one and one and two and two so consider our second row here are two three three two is a palindrome then our third row the same two three three two is also palindrome so one two two one is also the palindrome now for our columns one two two one is a palindrome then two three three two is a palindrome in our question the palindrome means when the list is reversed it gives the original one itself so 2332 is a palindrome here also palindrome and 1221 is also a palindrome so since the rows and columns are in palindrome we are going to print yes then consider our next test case where we have 3 cross 5 matrix in the first row we have 24342 which is a palindrome then 37873 is a palindrome then 56165 is a palindrome so consider the columns 235 is not a palindrome as when it is reversed it is 532 so we would print no now let us implement our program First, we'll get the number of rows and columns, then the matrix using the list comprehension. Then we will initialize the flag variable is all palindrome equal to 1. This will be used to print yes or no in our output. Then we use uh, nested loops for row in range R. Now we will initialize a list to check the rows. Row wise equal to list then for column in range c the row wise dot append of matrix row and column so we have appended row wise now we are going to check if it is a palindrome or not so if row wise not equal to row wise minus 1 so if it is not a palindrome then the isol palindrome will be changed to 0 now the same statements for the column so it will be changed to column here it is c here it is r here it is row here it is column here it is column, here it is column wise and here also column wise. So since they are not a palindrome, our is all palindrome will be changed to 0. So now if is all palindrome is remains 1 if all the rows and columns are palindrome. So if even one row is not a palindrome or even one column is not a palindrome then is all palindrome will be equal to zero so if is all palindrome are equal to equal to one then we are going to print yes else we are going to print no now let us execute our program let us consider the first test case where we can clearly see that 
the all rows are palindrome and the, all the columns are palindrome so we have the output yes then we'll check for our next test case here all the rows are palindrome but not the columns so our output is no now consider the next test case we have got yes as all the rows and all the columns are in palindrome hope you guys understand thanks for watching see you in next video